All right, let's do this. What's up, everyone? Empowered Q is here, bringing you some more League of Legends action. We are going against some of the Crocodile Man here, so it should be pretty good. He's walking away from that level one trade. He knows. Oh, good Crocodile Man. You know. Respect the Jack's damage. Um, I think it's going to be pretty good. I'm probably going to go for a pretty big split-heavy uh, build. Maybe some Blade of the Ruined King, a little Stairax, Rage Blade, Trinity, all that good stuff. Um, the reason being, if you look at their team, Vagar, Twitch, Morgana, not really something I want to be a part of, to be honest with you. Um, just don't feel like jumping into that's going to be very good. And we have a ton of disengage, so... Nice, got the level 2 advantage. Pop my potions, nice. Don't want to let him walk up here. Keep him pressured. Popped his potion. Very good. More free damage. Good. Alright, Chaco's contesting, so I can maybe walk up. Yeah, T's pushed there, so if uh, he comes... Yeah, he's going to back up. Oh, he flashed. That was close. I thought I had him. He flashed out of my E. I think that was the right play if he did not... React to that fast enough, he would have been dead. Uh, well, I got the cannon minion EXP at least. It's a little rough, but... That was a really bad trade by me. I walked right into that. Don't judge. Gonna pop a potion here. Get a little love tap there. Back up. Don't let him get the heal off. Make sure this wave pushes. I'm close to being able to all in him. I gotta wait up for my E. I'm gonna ward down over here. This wave is gonna push out to me now. Dead. Yep. Easy peasy. Nice. So just get the stun off, and once he's stunned, I pop my ignite. EMI probably honestly didn't even need the ignite, but I'll take it. Cool. So I'm probably going to go for a pretty aggressive buy here. I'm going to go Doran's Blade. That's going to give me some lifesteal and some sustain to match his. And I'm going to start working towards my Trinity. So I'm going to grab a Longsword. And I'm going to grab a Reju Beat in just a second. That's going to build into my Tiamat. That gives me a little extra sustain. So a little extra note is I've talked about the level 1 cheese before. Um, there's kind of an added bonus to it now with the changes to Rift Scuttler. It's about your level 2 to level 3 that that pops up and you want to go down and contest it. Um, so by getting that early push, it allows you to kind of match up with your jungler like I did with Shaco. I was a smidgen late on it, but uh, the idea is still the same. So something to keep in mind. Damn, I missed the experience. Unfortunate. Yeah, I'm not going to want to be anywhere near that Twitch. So, damn. Splits pushing it is. There you go. There's my level 5. Cool. Yeah, he just got a longsword. So, I have a decent amount of a buy ahead of him. Uh, if he backed, I want to hard push this. Because he doesn't have TP and I can look to make a play. Get some deep. Oh, shit. Yep. I don't think he's going to get that. If he doesn't get that, this is huge. I want to push this as fast as I can. Whenever someone makes a roam, you want to push the wave in. So that's going to go in. Now this gives me time. We get a ward here. Pressure him off the wave. Cool. As soon as this pops, I can grab that. That's going to give me half my mana back too, which is huge. So we shoved that wave, so we're really not going to miss anything out here. Miss out on anything here. Perfect. Got my mana back. Head back to lane. Nice. Not going to miss this cannon this time. I got some vision here and here. He doesn't have any rage, so that's always a good time to fight him. Nice. Pop a potion. Ow. That sucked. Hmm. I don't know if I get level 6 first here. Or... Cool. So you want to do a 1-2 punch. My potions. 
Damn it, I couldn't get my W off. I was so close. I was mashing it. Damn. Let me get my boots and a cloth armor here. That's my bad. We'll get it back. No worries. He got six uh, from a minion kill, which that's what I was worried about. Hmm. Lame. I'm going to miss out on all those minions, too. We'll get it back. Wow, it's 7-3. to three. That's that good. Bot lane is super feeding. Yeah, so I am going to go Trinity, Sterix, Blade of the Ruin King, Rage Blade. I think that's going to be really good against the Renekton. Uh, he falls off too, or I do not. So I'm a little behind on a minion. It's about 4 right now, but that's cool. I'm going to have my Ignite up for next fight. Yeah, I took that really bad trade at the start of that fight, which was super not good. Gotta avoid stuff like that. You gotta E. The key to the Renekton matchup is you gotta E his W. Wait for this. Nice. So you wanna attack twice and then jump. So you wanna one and then two and then jump. The reason being is it stacks with your passive. He's got his TML. Okay, he's going to push really hard. Oh, my goodness. It hurts. It hurts. There you go. If he does that, that's what I want to do. So I want to get a ward down. Um, pop another potion here. Easy peasy. So I had to, I had to uh, take him out with my E, and as soon as the Renekton was dead with my Ignite, take out the easy target first. Kill them both. And with the red buff, I should be able to take out this tower. I might be able to get first tower too, because he used his uh, teleport earlier. If I could get this, this is huge. I don't think I will. It's going to be too close. I want to want it back. I want to finish pushing these. And back up. Well, I got a big minion advantage, a double kill, some red buff action. So that is huge for me. Um, So... He the problem with not going Merc, tre Merc Treads, if I get hit by... Ah, uh, you suck. I need help. Is Plant up? If Plant's up, I'm okay. Please be up. Yes! So I can stick around, because I have red buff, so I just need the mana. Cool. We're good. I can stay for the Shaco gank. Let's see here. Yeah, let's wait for Shaco to come. Oh, fuck. I think we got it. Do I have enough mana? I don't have enough mana. Damn. I had enough mana for the jump. They're going to get first tower, too. Close. I didn't have enough mana for my Q. Lame. Oh, God. What is my E60? Got the kill. Oh, I got the kill on the Renekton, so I'll take it. I had way too much gold on me. I really wanted to back earlier. But what can you do? Are my boots. Well, I think I'm going to go boots into awkward buy. I wonder if I could do this way. It's probably the best right there. Get my sheen. Hmm. Yeah, definitely going to be a problem. So split pushing. It's going to be the way to go. Renekton teleport. Oh, okay. Well, push out top, take that tower, then look to make a roam play. 
So, got that juicy double kill earlier. And the Tiamat is going to allow me to push really, really fast. I'll eventually turn that into a Titanic. Because I will probably eventually build a Randowin's Omen, especially if I feel I need to adjust my plan in team fight. Um, I'm going to need it against the Twitch. And uh, what I was saying about Merc Treads is the downside of not going Merc Treads is, is if I get hit by any of their CC, it's going to suck. Viger, Baby Cage, Morgana Stun. The good thing is most of this stuff is pretty dodgeable. If I don't suck, then I should be able to uh, dodge it. Yike, Aronis. Gonna get a ward up over here. I really like this ward because it spots out both blue buff and gromp. We see Jin Zhao. It's one of those things where I feel like if, I, ow, if I ever catch the Vagar, he'll die. But I gotta catch him, which is not gonna be easy. Ow. Mm, just start maxing Q, especially if I'm going to be against Vagar. Mm, definitely not who I want to be landing against. I'm going to grab the Rift Scuttler. He's gone. It's probably roaming. Shove this in. Shove this in. Help my team that way. Yep, there's the Vagar. I could take this, and then I see blue buff is up, so I can go that way. Okay. Nice. Vagar's gonna suck. Bring it over this way. Got it. <laughs> Almost didn't. Okay. Um, Vagar flashed. Might be able to kill him. I see Jin Zhao over here. I got my Ignite. Oh god. Got it. Whoo! Nice. Good job. I'm gonna back because if Twitch opens up on me, I am dead as dead can be and I have 2,000 gold. Sweet. Yeah, I knew I could get the Vagar. He was way too pushed forward. Had to wait for him to do his baby gauge so I could get around it. This way. Damn. Saw my Dorans. Don't really want to, but... Do you have that tower? No. Alright. Head back to top lane. Clear out this wave. Get my Trinity Force. And then start building towards... Probably gonna go... Steric's Blade of the Ruined King. Or I might go... I'm gonna go Blade first. It'll keep me uh, in lane longer. Blade, Steric's... Rage Blade, and then Titanic. Yeah, I like it. Don't have any vision, so I have to be careful. Mm -hmm. You don't want any of this, do ya? Got the flash out. <laughs> he can't handle the jacks. Alright, so push this out. I see Vagar, which is my big... Well, Twitch is my biggest concern. Help him get Rift Herald. That way we can get mid-tower with it. Okay. Rift Herald, then mid. I'm gonna pop a potion, keep myself healthy. Mm. Yep, I'm out. Yep, can't help you, buddy. Solid. Good play. That was... 
I'm impressed, not gonna lie. I did not expect that to go that well. No, no, I'm gonna push one more wave. And that way I can make a different roam. It's a cannon minion wave. No, don't do a cannon minion. That way it'll be set to reset. Perfect. Yikes. Mm, okay. I want to get my Trinity Force and start building towards my blade. Got one of those. Control ward. All right. What was that? Let's kill the Renekton, yeah. He's weakest. Nice. Cool. And get a ward here. And then contest red. Oh, clicked my screen the wrong way. That sucks. Clear this wave. I didn't realize how weak Xin Zhao was, though. I definitely want to contest this red. Okay, go that way. Contest red. I don't see anyone, so I'm going to pop a potion. I got to be super careful. There's Xin Zhao. Nope, got the heal. Got the heal. Got the heal. Run away. Run away. <laughs> Wait till my E is back up. Stay safe. Nice. Oh my god, get me out! <laughs> hey! <laughs> I knew they'd all be out red. <laughs> Get the dragon, I could push down a uh, bot tower, then go back. Got me a lot of gold. Oh, it looks like that's easy as plan too, so I'll let him do that. I want to go back anyways, because I'm super low. He's a little safer than I am anyways. Cool, I'm actually just going to buy the uh, Bork component. The Cutlass here. It's going to help me slow down the Renekton and catch up to him as well. Cool. Turn to that over there. And, uh, hey, I want to go bot. Push down the tower. If I ever catch the Twitch, I have my flash to kill him. As long as he doesn't have the Morgana. If the Morgana's there, I can't. If he's by himself, I kill. Mm. Yeah, he's too strong for me to fight that way. Jaco's going to cover top. I see Twitch. Really? Bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get out of here. Hmm. Yep. Yep. We're gonna have to waste her shield on her. So I'm able to just flash on the Twitch and kill him. Super easy. Push this tower down. Good job, Nami. Thanks for the assist. Uh, Life steal, steal saved my skin. That's what I mean by the split push. Like. I could deal with just one source of CC, but when they do this, 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 and this, there's just not a whole lot I can do. Get out, get out, get out, get out! <laughs> oh god. Ugh. Thanks, Tommy. I love you. Run! <laughs> Run! <sighs> Scary. I have so much gold. I'm sure I can get my blade. 
Yeah. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. One thing to look out for is fighting in minion waves, kind of similar to Yasuo. If you can fight in a wave, you always have kind of a way to get back um, if you don't have a ward. So, something to keep in mind. Oh, she did. Nice. My blade. And then start working towards my Sterics. We'll go Sterics into Rage Blade, like I said. And the health component is going to help us just stay alive. This is going to get another wave pushing here. And I'll move up this way. Because look, it's a cannon wave. Look at all the minions. Look at all of these. These are going to die before almost any of these die. So reinforcements are going to catch up again. And get the wave even bigger. So I can grab these because I have a second. And then I can pick up a nice juicy big wave. So what you want to always do is push right past the river. And that's how you make that happen. So went bottom. Made the play. Took a tower. Come up here. See here's the reinforcements. Nice. Cool. And they're at that point where one of my 10 and 2, honestly, like, in order to beat me, I feel like they have to send Vagar because I don't have a whole lot of magic resist. If anyone's going to kill me, that's who it's going to be. So I see Renekton, Twitch, and Morgana. We're just mid. So I got to wait to see anyone else. I can put a ward right over here. Check Wolves. There's Vagar. Renekton. Clear this wave out. Okay. I see Jun Zhao and Twitch at the bottom. Well, fine. Ooh. Nice. Oh, God. I hit the tower. I fucked that up. Messed that up. That's uh, fine. I'm just going to head top. Get that wave. Deal with the Renekton. Wow, what a misplay by me. I need to keybind um, target champions only. That would be super helpful for situations like that. So, pressure this in. I could go look to take blue buff and gromp as well. Yikes. Okay, take this. I can look to team up. I'm on my way, buddy. I'll go this way. Yep, there's Renekton. We could take Mountain Drake. I have a blade, so we take it really, really fast. And then I can split more bottom lane. I think we still need a lot for our Sterics. I think it's like 20... I think it's 3,200 in total. It is. So, 2,800 left. Well, I need 2,800, so I need about 700 gold. 500 more. Gonna go check the golems. Take these. A good strategy when you're always at is take away resources. If they don't have jungle camps to farm, then they have to rely on waves. Ooh, he's by himself. Easy peasy. Don't give him any time to react, to just flash. No ADC. You don't want this. As soon as she uses her shield, I know I can go on whoever isn't shielded. Pretty easy. Need 
bed. Easy peasy, that should be game. Hmm, we'll get the tower. Can't handle it, man. <laughs> Just that one misplay at the beginning. I think really my only mistake is that one misplay at the beginning against the uh, Renekton. I let him get that really good dash. Uh, empowered W trade in that just wrecked my health. And I made a slight, slight, uh, miscalculation right there. Alright, I think I can just hold on for a second. I'm just gonna get my Titanic because I'm so close. Sell my Corrupting Pot, and then uh, I'll go for Rage Blade after. Yeah, we didn't want that to happen. Mm. Me and Shaco have practically the same score. Yeah, by the time I'm up, I'll have the extra 40 gold, and then I'll start building towards Rage Blade. will be my final item, and I will be stupid strong. Uh, Vagar was going to kill her anyways. I don't think they can Baron. Cool. Nice. Yeah, they're going to get the Rift, but... Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Let's see. I think I'm going to pressure bot lane... Oh. Yeah, she's warding over here. Ooh, lucky. Lucky, lucky, lucky. Well, your red buff is belonging to me. I'm gonna take this and then pressure bot wave. I don't know what Mal's is doing. He should be with the team. But if he's not going to be, I should join. Because I have so many more escapes than he does. Wow, he's level 13. Crazy. They have it. I'm going to steal blue. Dead. <laughs> Dang, I really got caught on the end of that. That sucks. I gotta leave. Gotta leave. Back it up. Gonna buy the uh, attack speed component here. And head back. They should be able to pressure this wave. They're down three, so it's a 2v2. Yeah, I can get that. Grab the Rift Scuttler. Level 18. Let's see. <laughs> Poison Zhao got wrecked. Top, open, inhib. Yeah, you can just go top, open, inhib. They don't have the tower, so it should be pretty easy. All the waves are going to naturally push in, so. Not that they can really come and contest, but. Alright. Alright, get these to go. Walk top. I'm not 
Not really the best pathing, but I'm not really worried. I'm just gonna walk over. Where's my team? Jump, 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 jump! I could not jump! Damn Zanyas. Not the best play. Perhaps a little too greedy by me. I got melted. Holy crap, Twitch melted me. I wasn't paying enough attention to my team. Yeah. I thought I got the Twitch in a snare, and I thought that my team could follow up, but did not realize how weak he was, and I don't think Shaco was ready for me to do that. Yeah. Melz has to save his alt for him. Whoopsies. My bad. I aggro. Uh. <laughs> Evented a little bit. A little bit. Not a lot. Alright. Head back to top lane. I need 2300, I think. Yeah. I really don't think I want to group. I think I want to split. Take away some more resources. Gromp's gone. Okay. Cool. Just take the inhibs. Let's be careful not to get caught. Nope. Uh, nice. Careful, I don't want to get like side uh, hit by Vagar. Push in, Shaco's going in. Cool, get the other in him. Let's back up. That's fine. That's fine. We'll just wait for Baron and end. Uh, I need like a hundred gold to get my rage blade and then I'm gonna take stuff stupid fast Cool back it up. Yeah, the uh, Twitch with guardian angel and all of that CC is gonna be a problem, which is why my initial plan from the get-go of this game was to Split push I'm gonna go grab Rift scuttler yeah, just barren an end. Um, we can force those minions. Shaco should be able to backdoor, no problem. We take Baron super fast. They can't really leave their base. Take Gromp. Nice. 10 seconds. And then we can actually Elder Dragon as well. So, just end it the safe and clean way.
Okay, just run it down mid. I could always sell my boots for Randwin's Omen. Grab this here. My flash is up, so. Let's get all these pushed in. There's really not gonna be anything that they could do. Back it up. Keep all these minions going. Damn that Twitch, man. Go shake a go. 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 <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. I said that's that's a problem with those games where or that makes the most sense to split push ending it becomes super hard because we couldn't get them out of their base, but like going in on them like I try to kill any frontline people I can't get to the twitch because the Morgana shield and then you know we got a Zanya's here and we got a Zanya's here like I can't kill these people can't kill the twitch but I could kill the Renekton over and over and over and over and over again but uh, I think that was a pretty good game let's check some damage charts and boom number one damage what up what up what up so but yeah that's that's the important thing uh, about the Renekton you saw the first kill I got where I did it properly, but the way he wants to play that is dash in, wait out my E, or if I, or what happened before was I E'd him, jumped away, and I didn't get away fast enough, and he dashed, got his W in after my E was down. So it's all about playing around that E cooldown versus the W cooldown for the both of you. So if you're Renekton playing against Jax, that's how you want to do it, and vice versa. Well, I hope you guys liked that one. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good jazz. Tune in next time. Peace.